Usain Bolt isn't the fastest athlete on the planet. Dude can't even run with a ball. See, football is a fast-paced game, and some ballers are so turbocharged, they're like speed engines. So I just had to make a list of the 10 fastest players in the world. And to kick it off, my OG Kyle Walker. This dude is so fast, he's like a freaking cheat code. Kyle Walker is one of the most legendary defenders in the game. With an intimidating physique and a body that match, he's like a tank. But you see guys, Kyle's got something else going on for him. And that's his speed. It's almost illegal. The dude doesn't even have to break a sweat in the tackle. He just pulls up another gear and owns the yard. Ever since he switched clubs to City in 2017, his game has kicked up another gear. Literally. Kyle clocks a top speed of 35 kilometers. And that's faster than the average road bike. Dude is competing with machines now. And as crazy as this is, Kyle's speed is the slowest on the list. And this next dude is so fast, they legit created his own speed chan. Mohamed Salah is incredible. He scores almost every week. And can't stop leaving defenders for dead. But the goals and assists aren't the only thing in Mo's locker. He's so fast, he's like Egyptian lightning when he's on the ball. In 2017 to 2018, Salah moved from Roma to Liverpool and broke all kinds of records. He scored 32 goals in a Premier League season, and that's more than anyone else has ever gotten. Salah also holds the record for being the fastest Liverpool player to reach 100 Premier League goals. The dude can't stop, literally. After Liverpool fans caught a whiff of how speedy this guy is, they just had to create a special chant for him. A Mary side Grammy all about Salah's speed. Mo Salah, Mo Salah, running down the wing, Salah, the Egyptian king. Even his club chant hypes up his pace. Amazing! Salah clocks a top speed of 35.50 km per hour. That's faster than Kyle Walker, but it's still behind the Black Panther, Aniki Williams. Now, if your nickname is the Black Panther, then you know something's up. Aniki Williams is Mr. Reliable. He holds the record for the most consecutive games played in Europe's top five leagues. He legit played every game for 251 matches, and there are only 38 games played in a season. Aniki, like Salah, has been setting records on records. His quick feet and dribbling ability, combined with a top speed of 35.62 km per hour, make him an incredible talent, and he's become such a huge fan favorite that the fans nicknamed him the Black Panther. And I ain't gonna lie, it's pretty cool. But he's still a few kilometers off this next dude, and this one's special, man. He's aging backwards, literally. Kareem Bellarabi is the modern definition of speed, man. In 2020, he was officially named by the French newspaper, Le Figaro, as the second fastest player in the world, only behind Kylian Mbappe. And it gets a whole lot crazier, too. Unlike the other players on this list, Bellarabi is getting into his mid-30s, and he's still got pace for his age. Dude's the flash of football. His top speed is 35.38 km per hour, and he's not even stopping there. Bellarabi also holds the joint record for scoring the fastest goal in Bundesliga history in just 9 seconds. Incredible! Now, he's fast, but Adama Treor, he took the speed game to a whole new level. Hold up, is this dude a footballer or an ultimate bodybuilder? He looks like he's playing the wrong sport, but he's a beast on the field. Apart from his dominating physique, I mean, seriously, I wouldn't want to get him pissed off. He is incredibly fast. Because of his speed, the coaches at Wolves had to create a whole new invention just for Adama. He's getting oiled up like a machine now, so defenders won't be able to pull at him when he takes off in matches. With his unique body build, people don't usually expect Adama to be that fast, so his pace is stunning. Adama's top speed has him clocking 36.08 km per hour, and he doesn't seem like he's stopping anytime soon. The only issue Adama's got is his finishing. I've got more goals than this dude, and I play Sunday League football. He has 9 goals and 13 assists in 131 games. Come on! Well, at least he's got something going for him. But you see, killing him Mbappe, he's the perfect combination of speed, skills, and everything in between. Killing Mbappe is on his way to becoming the GOAT in the game. Goals, assists, skills, a world golden boot, he's right down about everything. Mbappe's the ultimate cheat code in the game. Literally. Dude has 99 pace on FIFA, man. No wonder they made him the cover of three years in a row. My boy's got a speed ticket to success. See, FIFA recognizing Mbappe's pace is no joke. He's been tearing it up since he turned pro. I mean, that iconic run against Argentina in 2018 lives rent-free in my brain. 
Mbappe clocked a top speed of 36.08 km per hour, but it's only enough to have him in the top 5. Sorry, Killian, this ain't FIFA. The dudes on this list aren't playing games. If speed is a test of mental strength and physical ability, then Marcus Rashford has been acing it every single match day. Marcus Rashford is probably the most popular baller in the world right now. This season, he's been in terrific form for Manchester United and kicked another gear. His new celebration is making waves all over the world. I mean, it's like a virus. He has five-year-olds hitting it in the bathroom stalls. A huge part of Rashford's game is his pace, the ability to quickly switch up and leave defenders for dead, and still find a finish in all of that. Nah, you can't coach that. It's breathtaking stuff. With his incredible speed, Rashford is up at 36.30 kilometers per hour. And with the way he's been playing this season, this dude ain't slowing down anytime soon. Nah, not at all. There's something Marcus isn't even telling us. He's up 18 goals in the league. This is amazing. But here's the crazy part. It's 16 off this next speed demon. And he's legit the definition of a cheat code. Erling Haaland isn't human. Not at all. I mean, come on, the dude is 6'4", built like a robot, and has the shooting ability of an RPG. And the speed of a rocket. What's up with that Norwegian diet? Haaland's rise to fame has been meteoric. A rapid Champions League debut, moving to Dortmund, and now City. He's been in incredible form ever since. And he just can't stop breaking records. He's got the most hat-tricks in a single Premier League season, the most consecutive home hat-tricks scored, and will probably breaks Salah's goal-scoring record faster than I can finish this video. Part of what makes Halan so deadly is his pace, and it's a real brain puzzle. Halan is 6'4 and clocking speeds of 36.04 km per hour. <laughs> That's insane. To put this into context, guys who are as tall as Halan, like Sergio Basquet, is snail speed stuff. If Erling stays fit and keeps up this rate, he'd probably have to be playing with robots to break records. Terminator stuff. Halan's clock speed is 36.04 km is faster than a Honda Jazz car, man's competing with vehicles now. With a speed like that, it's gonna take something special to top Erling. And that's where our next one comes in. Akraf Hakimi. At this point, watching Hakimi sprint past the opposition is normal to his PSG teammates. He's one of the fastest players in the world. From his days at Madrid as a kid, his coaches knew from the beginning that he had a special talent, running. It seems like he doesn't even break a sweat in all these matches. His blistering pace and speed make him hard to catch up with. Imagine being a camera guy and having to film Hakimi on match days. I would need to check my heart rate. Hakimi has been setting speed records in every league he's ever played in. And because of that, FIFA upped his pace to 95. I'd give anything to unbox him and Killian on my ultimate team. At the World Cup, Hakimi combined with his pace and effective speed helped Monaco stun the entire world to become the first African team to reach the World Cup semifinals, where they finished fourth. And in the tournament, he clocked a speed record of 35.29 kilometers per hour, which is enough to have him on this list. But he just had to outdo himself and set a blistering record of 36.48 kilometers per hour. It's even sounding illegal, man. He could get a speeding ticket for running past people or something. Seems Hakimi has been using his pace to run past leagues, too. He's already played for Real Madrid and won the Champions League, played for Dortmund and won the German Super Cup, and played for Inter Milan and won Serie A, and played for PSG, winning League One last season. And oh yeah, he's still only 24. His career is just like his pace, lightning quick. But it still has to come in second place, because up next, we have the undisputed king of speed and football. And when it comes to this dude, he's got zero competition. Alfonso Davies was built to run. There's no debating it. Watching him sprint past players is a beautiful thing. But you see, guys, not everyone knew how fast Alfonso was until the game in 2020 that changed his life. Alfonso was repping Bayern when they faced Barca in the 2020 Champions League quarterfinals, and the stuff he did was insane. Nelson Semedo still has nightmares and flashbacks just thinking about it. Alfonso was first to everything in the game, and even left the legendary Lionel Messi looking dazed. Whoa! That assist for Joshua Kimmich's goal got so many people buzzing about Alfonso. And just a few years later, he set out on a new mission to prove his speed wasn't a one-off. And this time, he made history. In a match against Werder Brennan, Alfonso clocked 22.7 miles per hour during a truly electric dash down the flank. And he smashed the all-time speed record in Bundesliga history. On this list, Alfonso's top speed of 36.5 kilometers per hour is the fastest in the world. His top speed means he's maintaining his top speed 100% in every race. Amazing! Alfonso's life is incredible right now, 
scoring Canada's first goal at the World Cup and dating the beautiful Jordan Hurry Tema. Now this had me thinking of football superstars who've dated celebrities in the past, and you won't believe the women Ronaldo's hooked up with. Just click the next video to find out.